are you? So in this video, we're going to be taking a look at a tea by Stash, and this is called Christmas in Paris. Now, many of you have probably noticed that a lot of tea companies will release uh, special themed teas over the holiday season. Uh, you basically see towards the end of the year a lot of uh, Christmas themed teas, uh, you know, gingerbread teas, peppermint teas, all that sort of thing. And this is no exception. Uh, I've had teas in the past by this company, Stash, and uh, I was quite curious when I saw this one called Christmas in Paris. And it says on the box that this is a chocolatey flavor paired with lavender and cool mint. Now, to me, that sounds like an awesome combination. It may not be your thing, but to me, that sounds absolutely delicious. So, in keeping with the spirit of the holiday season, I will brew up a cup of this Christmas in Paris tea and let you know what I think about it. Okay, so this cup of tea is ready. I let it brew for five minutes. And just judging from the smell of this tea, uh, it smells excellent. Uh, it's a very unique uh, smell. I don't think I've ever had a tea that smells exactly like this. I can definitely smell the chocolate, I can smell the mint, and I can really smell the lavender. Uh, but it's not overpowering. It's actually very, very nice and just a really nice blend. I'm hoping it tastes as good as it smells because if it does, it's going to taste amazing. So I will give this cup of tea a try and let you know what I think. Wow, that's really, really good. I like that a lot. Yeah, just that blend is a real winning combination. The chocolate, the mint, the lavender, they go together perfectly. Um, I don't know if I've ever had tea with lavender in it, maybe once a long time ago. And again, to some people that might not seem like a very tasty ingredient in a tea, but I can guarantee you it's perfect. It's just delicious. Yeah, very, very good. This almost has... Uh, because of the chocolate, it has like a hot chocolatey quality to it. And that's not a bad thing. Like in a way, it's, to my taste buds, it tastes a bit more like hot chocolate and less like tea. But again, not necessarily a bad thing. Uh, this would be a great tea to bring with you uh, if you're the type of person who likes to go cross-country skiing on the weekend or go hiking during the winter or go watch a hockey game at the arena. This is the type of tea that you'd want to bring with you during those times. Uh, it would just be so perfectly suited for those activities. Yeah, I'm really enjoying this. Very, very good. I'm glad I gave this a try. Um, I'm sure a big part of why I love this so much is I'm, I've always been a real chocoholic. I love chocolate. <music> So that's my review of Stash Christmas in Paris. Really just a, a wonderful blend. I, I can't say enough good about this. I really, really loved it. Uh, one of the most unique teas I've ever had, to be quite honest, and uh, one of the most delicious teas I've had in a long time. So highly recommended if you stumble upon this. Uh, definitely give it a try. Thank you for watching. Hope you can join us again next time. Please give us a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and I hope you can join us again next time. We'll see you again. Take care. Bye-bye.